so in today's video i'll be making some chicken and uh, first i'll have to fetch some water to heat some water to remove the feathers this is how we fetch water in kisumu this is a well so hello guys welcome and welcome back to being Molijen, where we explore african village life so in today's video we want to make some chicken that we have already killed off camera and now we want to heat some water to you know remove the feathers ah, yeah we will then go ahead to remove that the feathers up. and for us to do that first wow. we are going to soak the chicken in the hot water for like a minute before removing the, the, the feathers so if today is your first day watching a video on this channel i want to tell you thank you so much for choosing to watch my video ensure you give me a thumbs up and also leave me a sweet comment down below and don't forget to hit the subscription button thank you so much for doing so and this was a teamwork we were exchanging so then i went ahead to roast it shallowly or how do i call it but just like a rough roast before cutting it into pieces It is now ready to be cut and my brother Sheldon is going to be cutting it into pieces. I'm going to go ahead now to wash the chicken then put it on fire. And this is how we light our fire. When the flame goes off, we blow it with a, 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 a metallic pipe. I placed the chicken to cook, added some water and covered it and let it cook. So as that was cooking, I went ahead to cut my tomatoes and onions, capsicum and coriander, respectively. That was salt. I then cooked it until all the water was drained or dry or evaporated. Then went ahead to fry it. So I'll add some cooking oil. This is oil. Then I will add, I will stir it for a while. And then I'll add my onions. I'll also cook this until the onions are wilted. And in the meantime, my niece Samim was draining some vegetables to pound. I then added my tomatoes and stirred for a while. Then I covered them to simmer and to cook off the acidity of the tomatoes. In the meantime, Samim was pounding the vegetables. I grew up seeing my mom do this. I don't know why. And then, as the tomatoes were cooking, or when the tomatoes cooked, I added my capsicum and I added some mochuzi mix, beef flavored mochuzi mix, and stirred for a minute.
added my cup, my coriander and then went ahead to add some soup then cooked it for further 10 minutes thank you for watching bye and see you in the next one subscribe